Good morning, Year 3. Welcome to our science class. Today's topic is shadow. Learning objective to understand that shadows are formed when a light source is blocked. Do all shadows look the same? Time to think. The answer is no. Shadows comes in different form. It depends on the object that blocks the light. Look at the picture and the diagram carefully. We have here the sun as the source of light. The sun's rays goes to the tree and our tree is an opaque object. It blocks the sun's light and it forms a shadow at the opposite side. Shadow was made when an object blocks light. Light travels in a straight line, so if it is blocked, there must be a shadow formed. Just like the man in the picture. From our light source, the man is an opaque, then it formed the shadow at the opposite side. The object must be opaque or translucent to make a shadow. If we use transparent objects, it will not form any shadow at all, as light will pass through it, just like the glass window. Again, the sun is our source of light. It passes through the window because it is transparent. If an object is moved closer to the light source, the shadow gets bigger. If an, if an object is moved closer to the light source, the shadow gets bigger. If an object is moved farther away from the light source, the shadow gets smaller. Take a look at these. I have with me a mobile phone. When I move this phone closer to our light source, the shadow becomes bigger. And if I move it away from or farther from our light source, the shadow gets smaller. So, shadows may be big or small. It depends how the object, object's position, is it afar from the light source or nearer to the light source. And for your activity, I'd like you to answer the task that is prepared for you. Choose a task that you can do best. Write your answers in your copybook and submit it and show it to us when we come back. 